Hello everyone, I'm back with another interesting video. You can see some green bell peppers whose scientific name is Capsicum annum. This is native to America and has been cultivated for thousands of years. The word capsicum comes from the word capsa which means box or from the Greek word capto which means to gulp and the pepper word comes from the similarity of the flavor of heat to that of black pepper but it is devoid of capsaicin which is present in other chilies. In this video, I'll show you how to grow capsicum from seeds without failing. Follow my secrets and watch the video till the end to get 100% results. Before that, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Germination process is very crucial. You need to follow my secrets to get good results. These are also called bell peppers. You know, these are called green bell peppers. We also have red bell pepper and yellow bell pepper. First, you need to collect the seeds from the vegetable. Actually, this is a fruit, a berry in a strict botanical sense. It is also called bell pepper because it has got a bell shape. In India, Australia, New Zealand and Singapore, it is called capsicum. And in other countries, it is called pepper or sweet pepper or bell pepper. There are 20 to 27 species of pepper found all over the world. Only five are domesticated. So here I have collected the seeds from the capsicum. So for germination, you need to take the seeds and you need to take small boxes like this, which are perforated. Do not use bigger box. This is the secret number one. And for potting mix, I have taken garden soil along with coco peat. Ideal conditions for germination is a moist and warm condition, which is 21 to 29 degrees centigrade in a sunny position. This is sensitive to cold. So a warm condition will be favorable for germination. Here I am filling up the small boxes with the potting mix and I will spread the seeds. Avoid accumulation at a place and try to sprinkle them evenly all through the surface. Then spread a thin layer of the potting mix over the seeds. Make sure the seeds are covered. Then spray water over these. Do not pour water as I used to say in many of my videos. The next secret is you will have to cover these boxes with plastic sheets like this. This covering will maintain a moist and warm condition which is favorable for germination of the seeds. Make some perforations on the plastic sheet which will provide air circulation. Keep it like this in a bright shade. Now after 8 days I can see some sprouts coming out. Yes, germination has occurred. I'm excited. I can see the green part of the baby plant. Here also you can see two or three green baby plants coming out of the soil. I've been spraying water every day as needed. So we'll again keep them in bright shade. Now this is the 13th day and you can see some more baby plants visible. Wow, I can see six of them. Germinating capsicum from seeds is very critical. I know because I had failed two times before and this is the successful attempt. In this box, I can see many of the seedlings. I'm very happy and excited too. Now, since the seeds have germinated, I will keep these boxes open in a bright shed. This is the 15th day photo. Now it's the 20th day and I thought of planting a baby plant into a bigger planter. I have taken a plastic planter. You can even take an earthen pot. For the potting mix, I have taken coco peat, vermicompost and garden soil and I'll mix them. If you have garden compost or cow dung compost, even you can use them. Now I'll choose one healthy baby plant and I will put that in the bigger planter. I will pot the other baby plants into other separate planters one by one. This is the part 1 video and in part 2 video I will show you till the fruiting stage. After placing the baby plant spray water till the whole potting mix is wet. Next, whenever the soil is dry, you may spray water. Make sure there's no water clogging. 
Keep this planter in bright shade for 2 to 3 days then expose it to sunlight after that. This is the photo after one week you can see true leaves have come out and they are growing well. Now the third secret is you need to take a green capsicum which is mature. Find a capsicum whose skin is turning yellow like this. That means this is a mature capsicum and the seeds will be mature enough to form baby plants. Don't take a capsicum like this which is fully green. It is not yet mature and the seeds will not produce plants. So follow my secrets to grow capsicum plants at home. Do subscribe to my channel, share my video with your friends, give a big thumbs up. I'll be making a part 2 video with these plants till the fruiting stage. Visit my channel to see more such interesting videos and I'll be back with another one. Till then, bye!